welcome, welcome, welcome back. And today, oh, today. So for the food, we have a African meal and my baby got McDonald's. <laughs> so we have African chicken. That's what I'm going to call it. It's like African jerk chicken, something like that. And then I have some jollof rice with some, the black stuff is called shito. So shito. But yeah, some jollof rice. We just came from our niece's one-year-old birthday party. Uh, we wore masks. <laughs> and um, yeah. Let's get into the chicken nuggets, double cheeseburger, and large fry. Thank you. Mm -hmm. And I oh, have ranch and honey mustard. We didn't press. Oh, go ahead, baby. Me? Mm -hmm. Thank you, Lord, for letting us see another day. Thank you, Lord, for blessing our families. That letting all of us see another day. The ones that haven't, rest in peace to all of you. We'll never forget you. In Jesus' name, pray. Amen. Amen. Mm -hmm. okay. No, they grilled this outside. I don't know what I want first. I'll go for the easy one. Mm. Mm. French fries and honey mustard. Perfect cooking and chicken. That wasn't red. That's, yeah, you know that color. It's done. spice kick to it. Woo! Mm. Wanna taste it? You gotta drink over there. Uh-uh. You're gonna have to give me off camera. Huh? You're gonna have to Wait. give it to me off camera. Here. I got the inside of the chicken. Mm-mm. You gotta do it off camera just in case it's too hot and I freak out. Save me a piece. Gotcha. I ain't gonna cry on nobody's camera, y'all. And she know I got acid reflux. I wonder if they eat with their hands or if they, um, they didn't even watch nobody eat. I wonder if they use forks mm. just to eat the rice. I don't know. I know it was Jamaican girl who used a fork. Because that don't count. So we're going to get straight into the topic real quick. Are we going to get into the topic? Might as well. Let's go. Mm. You want me to say it? My baby went to the doctor's the other day. Yes, today. Well, we oh, yesterday. yesterday. We started yesterday. Yeah. She got some blood work done. Mm -hmm. And then we went back today. Well, well, I went to the ER for something different. You know, just to be, I'd rather be safe than sorry. Mm -hmm. So, the blood work came back in. Come find out. Go ahead. Um, the doctor told me. He looked at me sternly when he came back. He was like, let me go check your blood work from yesterday. I'm like, all right, good. I don't got to do it again. So, um, came back. He's like, so, have you ever thought you had COVID? And I was like, funny you asked me that, because, like, back in March, I couldn't taste. I couldn't smell for, like, two and a half weeks. And it was bad. I had to be on my, rest my um, nebulizer a lot. Like, I almost went to the hospital. Like, I was this close she was she had 911 on the phone and I cried and said please don't call them but at that time I had COVID and I and didn't know thank God that she went through it but we were we got through it without anything serious going to happen so yeah because there's three of us in this house and we're very close family, so I'm surprised. 
I'm thank God that nobody else got as sick as I did. And we all made it through. So. Yeah. But that's just a crazy thought. Yeah, because he said I tested positive for the antibodies. And he was like, yeah, you, you had COVID. <laughs> I could laugh about it now because I survived. I survived COVID. I need a t-shirt. You're gonna have to get a t-shirt. I need a t-shirt. Cause that was, I've never felt that way before. I was in the bed. I was, yeah, you definitely, you were going through it. It was horrible people. But apparently did we, apparently we did a lot of good things while so. she was sick. I drank about five to six times a day, maybe more. I drank a lot of water, hot water, tea, really. There's this tonic. I don't know if you guys seen on my Facebook page, the Hottie Toddy tonic around that time. There's a reason why we were making that is because I had COVID at that time. And don't worry about that. Right. So we were making Hottie Toddy tonics. We were making tonics. Well, we call it tonic it's it's like a um you boil some hot water you put in a little apple cider vinegar a little turmeric um honey a lot of honey a uh, little lemon um what else sometimes we throw some cinnamon and, mm, I put cinnamon in and there, a yeah. few other spices up in there and it tastes really really good and it was we drank that a lot oh my goodness a lot and an emergency it, Mm -hmm. We emergency it up. Oh, emergency too. Sudafed. In the packet, and you put it in the water and stir it around. Sudafed, Theraflu, like. Mm. I was. We were doing the the Walmart version of the the, the nightclub cold and flu. Yes, yes, yes. And thank you, Lord. I didn't have to go to the hospital. Cause it was close there for a second. I would have made you go. It was close, y'all. And I would have been stuck in the hospital on a ventilator or something. Because I need oxygen. Because honestly, we really thought it was just allergies. Because we get really bad allergies in this mm -hmm. time. Those allergies were about to try to... I don't know. I'm just glad we're okay. I never want to be that sick again. Yeah, I forgot the paper towels. <laughs> You need to wipe your hands? Um, not for now. Just talking about that. <laughs> I know, I don't want to talk about it. And I'm not even <laughs> hungry anymore. I, I know. just want to come up here and share my story real quick. A lot of honey. A lot of hot yeah. tea. Green tea. We had the big, big, big containers oh. of honey from Stop and Shop, like the giant ones. We went to like went through like three or four of them things maybe even five that was crazy and that's when i was doing a whole bunch of those mukbangs and then all of a sudden because we weren't we weren't going around anybody it was right when the cousins were about to leave mm -hmm. and we did that big blue crab mukbang and for some reason i did one by myself and i just couldn't eat that's when I started. I still haven't been able to eat a lot since then. Like, <laughs> they say you have like little problems after. You do. My allergies have been kicking my butt ever since. And right now it's hard for me to breathe and I might have to take an inhaler. And this was March, okay? So I don't have it anymore. I have the antibodies. It just messed up my body a little bit. A little bit. Like it made me get my allergies. I don't know. <laughs> right? And my asthma. It was a little worse than it used to be. Where's your inhaler? Um, over here. Okay. But um, if you tuned into this video and made it this far, thank you. I'm about to um, finish eating my African shito. Okay, can you explain Enjoy to me what that is? I, I don't want to. Because <laughs> I want you to try it. 
one day, so. You know what jollof rice is, though, right? Oh, yeah. Well, you this is the fried jollof rice okay. that they make. Because, you know, you've you've made it, too. Mm-hmm. I just didn't make this version. Mm. It's a lot easier. The version I made, mm-hmm. some Africans don't even know how to make it. Mm. Especially the ones that live over here. Mm. Mm-hmm. Then I did an alright job, too, so. Good. Yeah. It was definitely good, actually. Yep. That shit was kicking, yo. Is it spicy? Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. It's not as spicy as the one I have downstairs, though. Mm-hmm. I took my pills today. Mm-hmm. I took the blue one. Mm-hmm. All right. Because I might have to take the other one early. Mm-hmm. <laughs> Acid reflux. That's what I'm saying. She's trying to get me off. Y'all hear that? Oh my god, oh my god. If you made this far, like, comment, and subscribe. Please like, comment, and subscribe. So you really put in that you, you subscribe uh, to me, I'll subscribe back. Just make sure you comment on one of my videos because sometimes YouTube doesn't tell me when somebody subscribed and what their name is. But as soon as I see them, even if you want to erase your comment later after I subscribe, I don't care. Just let me know you're there by a little comment or something. And like, hey, I subscribed or something, and I will subscribe back. What was that? Especially that last subscriber that made me into 48 subscribers. Mm-hmm. I cannot find your name. So hit me with a, hey, I, I was the last one to subscribe. Boom, so I can subscribe back to you. Because I heard you were a YouTuber. My wife hooked me up with that one. So I definitely have to hit you. Uh, and we're local too? Come on now. Mm. And the headline, you're really going to put that you tested positive? See who clicks on it? I did test positive for COVID. Oh, yes, she really did. So I mean, it's not a lie. It's not clickbait because it's real. Mm. Right? Yeah. Clickbait is something that people, it's a false. But this is real. I tested a positive for COVID antibodies. And people are out there partying and everything, just having it up, having a good old time. And we were so safe. I was safe, and I didn't go to parties. And I still got the shit. We stayed at home with I mean, quarantine. The COVID. I mean, am I allowed we, to say that? We didn't talk to anybody. We didn't go near anyone. We didn't see our family for like a whole month. Can I even say that on YouTube? I'm going to have to use your phone to see. Am I even allowed to say the C word? It's my life, right? Should we just start calling it the Rona? I don't know if we can say that. Oh, we can probably say the Rona. The Rona. The Rona. Yeah, that's what Cousin says. The Rona. Um, ooh, what was I going to ask you? Inquiring so, minds want to know. Something to do with the Rona. I'll come back. But that's amaze balls. We were safe. We were. That's what it is. We, we were so safe. Quarantined. We quarantined. We, we Lysoled everything. I should. Yeah. We Lysoled ourselves. Where came from. <laughs> oh my goodness! We wore gloves when we went shopping. We washed pulled them hands a hundred times a day. Lysol them. It more, well, we pulled them off because we knew how dirty the gloves were. Right, we, we Lysol We Lysol them. the money and then found out how dirty the money was. So then we started using our card and then we even messed up one of our cards because we Lysol so Because much. of how much Lysol we Lysol'd We Lysol'd the strip off. <laughs> yes. <laughs> In the clear plastic on the front. Yes. The sheen. The chip wasn't even working right anymore, so... And apparently we still got it. Still got it. Thank you, Lord. I'm still here because I survived. There's nothing short Not of a blessing. Not everybody can say that. It's nothing short of a blessing. Especially having complications already with asthma, anemia at the time, mm-hmm. and high blood pressure. Yep. And I survived. 
I didn't have to go to the hospital even though I should have. Because I was really, I couldn't breathe. Just like right now. I mean, I can breathe now. It's just. Can you get your inhaler, please? I don't talk a lot anymore. Why? Because I get out of breath. And that's probably another reason why I've slowed down on the mukbangs a little bit. Just trying to eat and talk. You, you see my plates though, right? Ridiculous. Okay, stop talking to her. Not eat. Nom, 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 nom. Yum, 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 yum. That's what I did to Julie mm. earlier. Oh, this chicken ain't done. We have to throw it in the air fryer. Okay. Because that is some good ass chicken. That looks good. Yep, we gotta air fry that. Mm. You want my last two chicken nuggets? Well, it's a good thing that I didn't eat it yet. Because he gave it to me right off the grill. He was like, uh uh. I seen them make a special. Her. You know, when Ghana men get together in a huddle around the fryer, I mean, around the um grill, something's up on that grill. That isn't in other people's plates. So I keep my head around there. I've seen the onions and stuff from the chicken. I was like, those special? He was like, yeah. Let me get one. So he gave me one. And then, because he was like, they're done. It, which, the legs are done. It's just the thigh that isn't done. And thigh usually takes a little longer. Yep, the leg is done. Because they checked that. Don't want that to get too crispy in the air fryer, you know. Mmm. It tastes a little different than the other one. Than the leg I just ate. Mm-hmm. The leg I ate was spicy. Mmm. This isn't spicy. Mm-mm. I catch my camera. It's not spicy. Okay. Okay. Not, I swear, baby. I wouldn't give it to you if it was. No, it's not spicy. I wouldn't do that to you. Unless I was trying to prank her. If I was trying to prank her though, she'd be able to tell. Because I'm a really bad liar. And yeah, she would have caught me. Yeah, mm -mm. Let me see it. Let me see your eyes. Let me see your nose. Look, y'all, the shake machine was working at McDonald's today. Yes. <laughs> Like, comment, subscribe, and check us back when we do the um, snack crate video.